Sean Hat. Get it, get it, details. Mm. Okay. Good morning, everybody. I'm Adam Howell. Welcome to look number 78. It's been literally over a year since I did a video. Um, I'm not gonna apologize for it. I'm just gonna keep pushing. But I gotta keep pushing. Um, the reason why I haven't did, uh, did a video in a year is because um, I've been working on projects, working on so much stuff especially my clothing line, which I've been really working on for the past decade. I didn't want to bring it out because it wasn't ready for production or anything. So I just kept it under the rug. And I was working on my styling. As you see on my channel, I just, my personal looks and stuff I've been styling, products I've been styling. So um, first, I'm gonna talk about my look and then I'm gonna discuss my clothing line. So let's, let's get it started. That's uh, for day. Military Parker and Tan. It's hard to find this colorway. I was looking for the black one. Still looking for the black one in my size. I found the tan one recently, so I was happy about that. As for the tea, this is from Anonymous Club. Shane Oliver, you know did his thing on this. This is part of the two pack tea. So I have the other tea to, to go with it. It's, it runs pretty, it's actually really, really oversized. Like legit goes past my knees, pause. But um, yeah, the Anonymous Club is doing their thing. Shout out to Shane. I wish he um, was still at by Air, but you know, move on to bigger things, a bigger vision. I guess his vision with Anonymous Club and his other brands he's focused on it's bigger than hood <clears throat> excuse me it's bigger than hood by air but to each his own everybody has their own opinion about it hopefully hood by air come has a great comeback you got room for them as for the jeans today got a Rick Owen bowling banana cut these are the newer version from the actual OG banana cuts these are the newer versions as you see it goes all the way version is nothing like this but you know everyone loves the OG version but you know Rick always does great craftsmanship when it comes to his products so anything he you know makes the top quality now, I'll zip down to the bottom for you guys to see and for the feet since I'm on the feet I got the on it on the ass. Pretty sure you've seen these in previous videos before. Still have to show it. And as for the hat, this is part of my brand, Aaron Ayrton Powell 2017-2023. This is a sample. This is actually not even going to production. This is actually a one of one that's staying with me, but it's still a sample. Now I'm gonna go into my clothing line since it's starting with the hat. So yes, my name of the brand is Aaron Ayrton Powell, 2017-2023. The reason why I put those numbers is the births of my daughter's birthday. It was 2017, it was when my first daughter was born, Nirvana Alaya Powell. And 2023 is when Zoe was born. Zoe Phoebe Powell, you know. I know y'all were wondering like, okay, Phoebe and Alaya, y'all all know, y'all get it. So y'all don't, don't gotta explain too much. But yeah, those are the years it was born and I added it into my clothing line, you know, it's a family-based brand. And you know, I, I don't follow no format, no spring, summer, no fall, winter. It's just when I drop stuff, when I drop stuff. I don't follow no fashion industry, BS, you know, I, I don't care about that. You know, I just care about pushing what I love to create and that's it. You know, a lot of people tend to um, like bring stuff out, try to follow the trends or see what's going on in the, on social media and try to make um, product based off that. But nah, you just gotta, just, you know, create off what you love and, you know, who you are as a person. I'm not even about a person, just create, just create, um, then, ah, sorry, I came out wrong. I ain't this in so long, guys, sorry. So a lot of people tend to, uh, you know, follow trends and look for inspo on social media. You know, I, you know, I, you know, they just kind of go towards corporate America and not focus on like the, where, 
where the brand first started, you know, they don't, um, they don't stay true to themselves. They just, you know, I get it. You know, they try to make money because um, they have corporate on their ass and shit, but it's, um, it's bigger than that. Like once you start a brand, man, just, just, just stay true to that. Like stay true to the blueprint, nothing more. So I was saying this because you know, I, I, I just see a lot of brands, even like established brands that have been around for like centuries, decades, you know, after a while, it just becomes corporate and not um, creative anymore. You know, it's just uh, it's just a lot. You know, it's sad to see that. But um, with my brand, you know, I want um, I don't care about like the industry. I don't care about um, agendas. I just care about you know just pushing creativity. That's it mainly. Um, based on me saying that, a lot of my products will be one of ones. Um, sometimes it, I might have a size run dependent, but I just want to keep it real small. I don't want, you know, I, mean, I, I don't want to have too much. So I pretty much want to keep my collection small. You know, like, uh, not every, I don't want too many people in the streets to have it. You know, like I just want, really, you know, there's a very few. So if it sells, it sells. If it don't, I really don't care about that either. I mean, I'm, not, I'm not here to see if my, my product sells out, you know, just like, if I fuck with it, I fuck with it. I love it. That's mainly what my brand is about. It's my um, ideas and I'm just turning it into actual product and turning it into, you know, bringing it into reality. So, um, yeah, based on, based on that, that's that's pretty much what Aaron Ayrton Powell 2017, 2023 is about. Um, AAP, you know, that's for short abbreviation, if anything. Um, so yeah, that, that's like number 78. I haven't put no, um, no videos out in a long time. It's been a year, I'm working on so much things. Um, I can't tell you a time frame with my next video or if I even will ever have a next video, who knows? You know, I'll keep everything, keep everyone on their feet, on their toes, keep everyone guessing when I'm gonna drop a next video. So until then, peace and love.